Hi, my name is Rob McKinney. I am a uh, trial attorney here in Nashville, Tennessee. How can you avoid a conviction of domestic violence? There's a couple ways. One is whether you were the first aggressor in the incident. If you're not, that is a valid defense for a domestic violence case. One way that you can avoid a conviction is through the use of judicial diversion even if you are guilty of domestic violence. And it could be so slight as placing your hands on your wife's shoulders or your arms to restrain her. That is technically you're guilty of a domestic violence situation. There is a mechanism called judicial diversion that if you meet certain criteria, you can have your case expunged once you've been on probation for a period of time. The judicial diversion uh, acts as a uh, conditional plea of guilt but at the end of the probationary period, your case can be dismissed and expunged off your record like it never happened. In Nashville, there are other ways that you can avoid a conviction. With a plea bargain with the district attorney's office in which you could agree to a under advisement plea in which uh, you will do certain things and at the conclusion of which, if you do those things, the case will be dismissed. If you don't do those things, such as public service work, an anger management class, uh, domestic violence classes, then they will sentence you to jail. It acts as a carrot versus a stick. If you do what you're supposed to do, you get the carrot. If you don't, you get the stick. There is another uh, uh, mechanism for uh, getting out of a uh, domestic violence case is a agreed order of continuance that is similar to the order uh, the under advisement plea in that that you enter into a court order that you agree to do certain things such as an eight hour anger management class a 16 week batterers intervention class and at the conclusion of which you come back with proof of that the case is dismissed those are just some of the ways that you can avoid a uh, domestic violence conviction without having to go to trial